Hi, my name is Kylie Carino and I have had the honor of completing my undergraduate degree here at Southern Connecticut State University. Our campus is a wholesome community that promotes student success. The Undergraduate Communication Disorders Program provides a comfortable learning environment that is student focused. The department pushes students outside of their comfort zone, which helps them grow as individuals and aspiring professionals. I have had the opportunity to interact with a variety of professionals on and off campus. Learning from professionals who have such vast experience has been invaluable for my academic career. Shadowing speech language pathologists at both the Yale New Haven Hospital and Orange Ave Elementary School in addition to observing at Southern's clinic has uncovered the importance of adaptability. I observe that working with populations of various ages, ethnicities, and abilities requires flexibility in order to provide the appropriate services. I am exceptionally passionate about advocating for my clients, especially for those who may communicate in unique ways. Having a voice for those who require services is a significant part of this field and something I excel at. Additionally, being the current Vice President of NISLA and an active member over the past few years has granted me the opportunity to gain insight on matters directly related to my area of discipline. Holding a leadership position has been critical for my growth and is something I can build off of as I begin my career. As I make the transition from the classroom to the real world, I am confident that my experiences have created a strong foundation for my future, while my ambition will continue to motivate me to learn more. Working collaboratively with my colleagues will expand learning possibilities for me as a clinician, as well as for my clients. Using research opportunities to build a connection with professionals outside of my workspace will foster creative thinking and development. I'm extremely eager to pursue my career as a speech language pathologist and cannot wait to see where this path takes me.